Hi, baby. Hi. Meh. Meh. Your mom's behind you. Yeah. She's button hands with Flurry. Do you want to come say hi? Do you want to come here? Do you want to come here? Hi. Come here. Come here, sweetie. That's your... Yeah, that's your brother. Do you want to come here? Do you want to come here? Hi. doing. You're a camera bomber. There you are. Now let's see. Mm. You guys, they're nuts. <laughs> Hi, Tundra. Look at Dasher. Dasher is a very good mother, and she's just trying to protect, not protect you, just protect uh, resources. I, uh, I space the hay around a lot in the lambing pen, so they all have a, a good opportunity, but Dasher is just so fierce that she doesn't want anywhere near anything because she wants her babies to just to have it all. Great mother. This isn't even her, her lamb who's trying to, to, to nurse off her. That is one of Margot's. But about, um, I guess it's about 15 hours ago, right now at the time of me shooting this, it's about four o'clock in the afternoon, she had uh, two twin boys. And I brought them into the lambing pen about an hour ago. They ate and uh, found where the water is. Now Dasher's kind of butting heads against Flurry for uh, who is going to take care of their lambs the best. I just find it amusing that Margot's little uh, cow spotted lamb here, who uh, he's a painted desert, is like, Dasher, will you feed me too? Have you ever noticed um, in any of my lambing videos how the... Oh, Dasher is really going after Flurry. It's not just the rams who have butt heads like that. But if you notice any of my videos when the the mom will start walking away, um, they actually do that on instinct, but it's for the health and well-being of the lamb. Because it's better for them to eat small amounts at a time. Dasher has always been very um, assertive. Uh, she's just a great mother. That right there is Tundra. Um, he was the first lamb born of the season and um, the one that I, I bottle raised.
And that is Sugar Tree, who's usually the, the very first to alert if something is going on that's uh, not right. It might be um, someone going for a walk or a deer in the back or it could be anything. And that right there is Chambi. Who kind of waits for Sugar Tree to alert and then Chambi will go assess whether or not it's a threat uh, worth looking into. I don't know if you can pick up that little chewing noise, but Tundra's right next to my ear, ruminating. Do you want a camera? Do you want to be on the camera, Tundra? And down here we have Valentine, who I am currently bottle raising. Kind of just, um... Maybe getting the wrong impression about Tundra sex here. Just kind of nibbling. Long time. Here's the other little boy now. He's having a rest in the shade. It's probably about 75 degrees out, but I imagine it's pretty hard work being born. I'm gonna get out of here now though, so they can readjust themselves. Because everything is so brand new and scary, huh? You gonna come with me, Valentine? Okay, come on, let's go.